Turn your body in every punch, you take time for every punch, and later turn up the speed and the power. We see a left right straight punch followed up by a left liver punch. Now I'm starting with a left right straight forward punch followed by an uppercut finishing with a right straight punch. Now we are doubling the right punch. So we see a double punch. This is surprising your opponent. Now I make 10 right punches with full power. The same I do with the left hook. And 10 more, but now a liver punch. For all these punches you take time, but make them with a KO power. Here you see some punches with KO power. Watch how my whole body is behind the punch. Watch how I first working his legs and his attention is with his legs and now I'm following with the right straight punch. We use in kickboxing not only the normal front kick but most of the time a push kick. My trainer holds the back backwards and let it go. On that moment I lift up my knee to my chest and push the back away. This kick is to keep your opponent away from you. I do this left and right. Later on I do this in a rit rhythm after each other. In the beginning, this is difficult to stay in balance, because you have to put your weight in your kick. Now I make a left push kick and a right knee. After my push kick, I put left in front and step in with a right knee. You see, I don't pull my left leg too much back for my distance. The same for the right side. Here we can see some push kicks to the body and face. Here we can see it's almost a sideward kick straight into his face. Here I'm giving a left front kick into the face of my opponent. For the roundhouse kick, we take the banana bag. This is a longer bag than a normal boxing bag. I make a left jab, step sideways and forwards to the bag with my left leg, not straight towards to the bag. I kick with my right shin on the bag 
and pull my left arm for my face to block. For the left kick, I make a right punch and step in between, not straight towards the back, but now to the right to put your body in the kick and kick with my left shin on the back. Now I pull my right arm for my left face to block. Then I make left and right kicks in the rhythm after each other with the steps in between. After that I make double kicks with both legs. You see both kicks are hard because I turn my body in both kicks. After the front kick, I'm countering with a right punch to the head, which makes his defense go up, and I'm countering with a body kick. Again, watch how his defense go up, and the body kicks and lands to the stomach. Of course, the body kick can also be used to stop your opponent from coming forward. In this case, it's the punch what's causing the KO. The body kick after the punch brings him off balance.